The Daily Commercial News and the Journal of Commerce have unveiled their new series, Cracks in the Foundation, which seeks to explore substance use in the construction sector. Here are some of the stories that we covered all across Canada. Daily Commercial News reporter Don Wall spoke to three activists and construction professionals in St. Louis, Missouri, who approached the opioid and suicide crises from different vantage points, but all worked together. One of them, John Gall, retired director of workforce development for the Carpenters in St. Louis, talked about the causes of opioid misuse in the construction sector going back decades. Daily Commercial News reporter Angela Gismondi spoke with Paula Allen, global leader and the senior VP of research and total well-being with LifeWorks about a national survey they released which found that construction workers use more drugs and alcohol regularly than compared to other Canadian workers overall. And that number has increased even more since the onset of the pandemic. Journal of Commerce reporter Russell Hickson spoke with officials in Western Canada where the issue became so dire that in 2017, BC declared a state of emergency. Despite this, the issue has continued to persist. In the first three months of this year, nearly 500 people died from drug overdoses. To keep up with the series and its upcoming installments, keep reading the Daily Commercial News and the Journal of Commerce.